What's up everybody? Welcome back to Widow's World. It's your girl Jada Widow and I'm back again with another video. Today is Vlogmas Day. Uh, 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 I don't know what day it is, but whatever it is, it doesn't matter. But today's video is going to be my 10 go-to Christmas movie recommendations. We're coming in okay so we're starting hot and heavy starting at number one now these aren't ranked from like greatest to like least but we're just starting with number one the best man holiday come on best man the best man holiday is a classic black christmas movie i love it i feel like everybody should watch the best man holiday it's just it's so it's you got the drama you got the happiness you got the cheerfulness you got the you got the heart feeling you get the love representation like it's just it's like everything in one you will be going on a roller coaster and i personally was going on that roller coaster at a a very young age but it was like the one of the best christmas movies i ever watched like i watched that every year coming in for number two we're gonna go with elf if you guys never watched before i used people used to like talk about elf um when i was younger and i'd be like um it's not even a good christmas movie and they're like yes it is yes it is and i'm like no it's not you guys are losers i never actually said that but i watched elf anyway the children in here are yelling like crazy because they're running up and down and trying to fight each other anyway Elf. Elf is such a good family-oriented um, Christmas movie. I I love Elf. I was a hater when I was younger, but I came I came to the truth that Elf is like a really 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 good Christmas movie. And you haven't watched Elf, you should go watch Elf. I'm gonna give Elf like Elf is like a solid like nine. Like Elf is really good. The next Christmas movie is. Amadea's Christmas. I don't know about you guys, but I love me some Tyler Perry's Medea because it doesn't matter what it is It's funny and Medea's Christmas is definitely a funny one Like I don't even want to say too much because a lot of these movies are old and like a, a lot of people might have watched them But like if you don't want to watch them like I don't want to tell you nothing to ruin it It's definitely in the night for me Ow! I hope she annoys you to go downstairs anyway where was I? I didn't even know what I was talking about. Gosh. Oh, Medea's Christmas. That movie's a good movie too. Um, Jalen really interrupted me, so no, I don't remember what I was saying, but you should watch that. I think that's the third movie. Starting at number four. If this is The Grinch, go watch. The Grinch is probably my favorite Christmas movie ever to exist. I love The Grinch. The Grinch is me. I am The Grinch. We go together real bad. The Grinch is uh, that's literally one of the greatest Christmas movies ever. You should watch the old one, the the live action, and you should watch the new one, the cartoon one. I definitely like the old one over the cartoon one, but The Grinch you can't you can never go wrong with The Grinch. That is the top family Christmas movie ever. Sorry, I just want you guys to know how much I love The Grinch. I love The Grinch. Like I would love to see The Grinch like. In, in, in real life like come steal all the presents how about just just steal me too so we can go steal everybody else's gift together and I used to think that I was Cindy Lou Who and that daddy dealer was the Grinch I used to think that and that we can steal Christmas together that was just in my head I really thought I really thought I was Cindy Lou Who and now I have my very own Max get my cloak too much Blink if you need help. You're not supposed to blink. You're not supposed to blink. Stop. Okay. Anyway. <laughs> Movie number five. Five, five, five. I've Home Alone 1 
and Home Alone 2. Those, sorry, everybody was making too much noise in here, but those are one of the best, um, everything I'm saying right now is like the best Christmas recreations in my opinion, but Home Alone 1 and 2 are the best Home Alones out of like the Home Alone series in my opinion. Like, one... It was it was the starting it was like yes this is it and it set the tone for number two and we're like yes well we want more and then yeah and after that I don't care about the rest what number was that I think that was number five right then there's number six the Santa Claus the Santa Claus movie now they made like a series called like the Santa Clauses um, but I'm talking about the movies set the there's the Santa Claus then there's the Santa Claus 2 and then there's the Santa Claus 3 with Jack Frost the Santa Claus 3 with Jack Frost is definitely one of my all-time favorites so let's just put one two and three in there and I didn't really watch the series Kima was watching a bit of the series um, she likes it so I guess it's good but the Santa Claus 1 2 and 3 especially the one with Jack Frost Especially with the one with Jack Frost, that's definitely a 10 out of 10. That one, 10 out of 10. Like, I used to have like dreams about that movie. Like, anytime Christmas time was close, I was like, mm, Santa Claus from Jack Frost. Like, that was really me. And oh my gosh, off topic, but when I was younger, we used to do, um, me and my childhood best friend, um, we used to do like um, this um, Christmas tradition on like Christmas. We, at Christmas Eve, we would go to her house and then they would make like festival and fried chicken and then we would watch the uh, Santa Buddies or any Christmas movie that was there. And But normally it was, um, I think it was called San San Santa Buddies or Snow Buddies. It's that puppy, that puppy movie where the puppies, um, or like Santa's Helpers or something. But that, that Santa Buddy suit, oh, that's definitely a good family friend, um, family and friends movie family friendly movie that you can watch um but before i get off topic another oh my gosh i almost forgot number let's say let's call this number six um or number seven i honestly i should have been counting but i lost track number seven the perfect Holiday. That's a movie with Morris Chestnut. And when I first watched that movie as a young child, I realized that Morris Chestnut was definitely one of the most beautiful men I've ever seen in my life. And I actually had an obsession. I still kind of do have an obsession with Morris Chestnut because he's just so handsome. Like, wow. And that was a good, like, family holiday love story type thing. So I, I definitely recommend, um, what is it called again? The Perfect Holiday. I definitely re recommend that. Next Christmas movie on the list, number, let's say seven or eight. Number eight, Mistletones. If you are like interested in like um, musicals or any type of like singing shows or whatever, the Mistletones, I don't know which one, which twin this is. It's either Tia, 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 Tia or Tamara. I think it's Tia, whichever one. I think it's Tia, but I definitely, the Mistletones. That, that's another movie. All of this is 10 out of 10. 10 out of 10, my favorite Christmas movie. Let's call this video 10 Christmas movies to get to know me. Yup. The Mistletones, that one. Oh, I hope you didn't hear my belly because that was loud. The Mistletones, eight down. Eight down, eight down. Another movie, another Christmas recommendation is called Jingle Jangle. That's another family friendly movie they played that movie in here about a hundred and fifty times plus that's from when it first came out like the everyday was oh can we watch jingle jingle can we watch jingle jingle everybody was watching jingle 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 for hours on top of hours on top of hours on top of hours how can you watch the same movie over and over and over and over and over and over and over 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 again it hit november and as soon as november hit they were like oh jingle jingle no no more jingle jingle but jingle jingle is definitely a good christmas movie a lot of the christmas movies i like are really for kids 
and that's okay because little me loved Christmas and I still love Christmas till this day Christmas this time of the year like Thanksgiving Christmas like New Year's that is my favorite time of the year like it just feels life just feels right to me and I thrive in the winter time there's just something about me in the winter well I was born in the winter so maybe that's why I thrive in the winter time and I'm rambling again oh okay guys now this one I think this is number 10 now um it's the last Christmas movie I just watched this one now it's called the Noel diary um it's like a romance movie where this guy um he's like a big writer and then he meets like this girl who lived um I don't know if she lived in his area or whatever it's like big city guy meets small town girl but like she was on the verge of um engagement but then she met him and then they like fell for each other <sighs> the no that no the, the noel diary had me up clutching my pearls i was like wow <laughs> to be loved to be loved but that is a 10 out of 10 romance christmas movie that is definitely a movie that i watch all over again and just in case I gave you less than 10, the next movie we're going to go with is The Holiday Calendar with my girl, Kat Graham. I believe that's her name. She's the one from A Vampire Diaries. If you don't know, then um, I, I just searched up the movie. And with, um, what's his name? What's, what's Diddy's son's name? I forgot his name. Quincy. Quincy Brown. Yes. Mr. Star. That is a really good Christmas movie as well. It's whimsical. It's about romance. It just has, it really has that Christmas spirit. So, but yeah, this was just a little simple video of on uh, on my Christmas movie recommendations. Let me know if you guys watch any of these Christmas movies. I sh I really think that you really, 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 really should. I gave you guys some really like good picks, very versatile. Um, but definitely go watch those. Um, but yeah, that's the end of this video. So don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, turn on the post notification so you know when the next time that I post. And um, I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.